so right now i am in the danish king's garden uh, this is one of the must visit sightseeing places of Tallinn. This is important because Danish people were the first one who conquered Estonia and uh, the war that Estonians fought against the Danes to get Estonia was fought exactly in this garden here uh, and that's why this is important. Look at this city wall here that's a pretty Scandinavian architecture that we can see. There's a museum under the square tower. You can also walk under the city wall if you go in that round tower underneath until 300 meters and also you can drink a coffee up there for around five euros which is double the price of normal talent prices and uh, yeah just enjoy the city view from the top Another wonder of Estonia is this toilet out here. This was built in early millennia, so 90s and 2000 between that time. And it costed them 200,000 euros to build this. This is one of the biggest examples of corruptions in Estonia, as an Estonian guy told us. And you can still visit this toilet today. It cost 20 cents, but uh, maintaining it is very, very expensive even till today. So this is something to try, she said. Here is a beautiful church again. This tower is known as the Tall Harmans Tower and there's an Estonian flag up there that is always raised and taken down at dusk and dawn with Estonian national anthem. This is the church where Estonians speaking Estonians go. So it's a Lutheran church. It was Catholic, but the Swedens, when they, they changed the religion to Lutheran. And it's also the grave of a German ruler named Otto, which is inside. And his grave is right in front here. He was living a very lavish life with alcohol, women and all. And he wanted to wash away his sins, so he wanted his grave to be in in the church or in front of the church so that when people step into the church his sins will be washed entering that church cost two euros the other russian church it did not have any entry charges we just went inside our guide told us that estonians are very slow they speak slowly they walk slowly and they do everything slowly but they are just running she is just running i don't think estonians are slow Wow, we are heading to the best view of Tallinn, Estonia right now. This is just near Fairs and Kovig Bar. When you walk inside, you will see the whole sea until Finland. We're gonna go there soon, so at the moment, I'm not gonna talk about it, but if you see anything interesting over there, simply point it out to me and I will cover everything to you, okay? This is the uprising Bohemian hipster city area of Tallinn and we were there last night. Check out my reel on this. That side is Finland. And this side is Russia, so St. Petersburg. Estonia was conquered many times by Danish, Sweden, Russians, USSR, Germans. So all the architecture that you see in an Estonian city, it is not very Estonian. It's from the different civilizations that conquered it. Just this part here, it's the Bohemian hippie part and there, there are wooden houses. That's the Kalamaya area and that is more of an of modern Estonian architecture.
So right now I'm in the iconic Tallinn Square and we just finished our tour. Tallinn is an interesting place and we ask our guide for some local specialties or local food, medieval food and she told us about Old Hansa uh, medieval hotel. So we're, we're going to try some food there. Let's see how it is. Old Hansa! This is the back door. I don't know if we can go inside. Old Hansa Hotel is right under this church tower and these are they serve delicious dishes of merchant home. Catherine Dominican Fiari's tombstones of 15th century and this is the famous Catherine's Passage it's a photogenic place here as soon as you come out of the Catherine's Passage you can see this city wall and garden of the Danish king so we are now going to climb on this wall and walk on that passage up there when you are in Tallinn, always travel by the tram. The trams here are very well connected, they are fast and they take you to almost all points in the city. They are also very cheap. So one day ticket is just 4 euros 50 and three day is 7 euros 50. I think it's a very cheap deal because in that ticket you can travel whole of Tallinn. Also until the outskirts of the city if you want to go to Hapsala beaches or Kadri or where we are headed right now. Also to the different waterfalls here like this Jagala waterfall you can go there too. This is the Kadri Oru Park near Kadri Org Art Museum. This was built in the 18th century by Asar Peter the Great. So now I'm going to take you to the city center of Tallinn, its capital, and let's explore all the different buildings or the history there. So right now I'm in the Sadama area of Tallinn. This is the area where you'll find offices and also a port. There are lots of yachts which you can book. There are huge ships. Might be wondering why am I wearing a thick jacket in so much sun because the weather here is very cold. It is seriously very cold. The sun is just an illusion. It is providing no heat to us at all. Now we are going that side. That's the coastline between Sweden and Finland and that side is Sada market. So let's explore that. Because this is a big port so there are lots of harbour markets. Also there's a terminal. You can see rice terminal A passenger. So there that is the point where you can board cruises. Also this Sadama market here because of the vicinity to the port. This place is very close to the old town. So we walked I think 800-900 meters and we reached at the coast. Also our hostel which we booked it's very very close from the hostel that we booked that was very cheap and we got it at a prime location. City center is close to it, port is close to it. From here you can also take cruises to go to Finland, to go to St. Petersburg and to also go to Sweden, to many places. You can see the huge cruise boats also behind me. We have cruises in the Sada market ke paas. and I think the market was not open, just restaurants were open, so there was not much to see. So we have come and we have seen steps. Dekhe. There were at least four floors of 25 to 30 steps each that we climbed and we came here to Lena Hall and here the view is the whole Estonia, the whole Tallinn city ka. just look beautiful if you want to know where we were staying our hostel is right there this the pole hai, uske baju ki, jo yellow building is there that is exactly our hotel hai. and behind that the church is the city center so there is a lot of proximity the sea, ko bhi, port, ko bhi, city center and the food area is a hippie area like everything is very close by all the attractions of Tallinn Yeah 
Isn't the view lovely? Look at the cruise boats, the vast sea. वो सी के आगे ही फिनलैंड है यू कैन सी हेल सिंह की आई थिंक वेरी वेरी स्मॉल वेरी मिनी एच ऑफ व्यू ऑफ हेल सिंह की एंड द वास सी एंड दिस इज टैलेंट सो येस्टडे वी वर हियर दिस एरिया ऑल दिस एरिया राइट हेयर काला माया काला माया इज कॉल्ड द फिशरमैन विलेज एंड इट इज ऑल्सो द हैप्पी एरिया वेर यू गेट रियली गुड फूड and uh, wooden estonian houses so if you come here do check out the area After the harbor you see this tram station and lovely garden in between the roads to walk how beautiful the city is this is the balti jama turk i think tour means market and here is the biggest uh, organic food fruits vegetables market that i saw here is also a very big supermarket and food area a big train station this is the balti jama area and also behind this is the hipster area सुबह का मिडीवल खाना काफ़ी हैवी हो गया था सो वी वॉन्टेड टू ट्राई समथिंग इंडियन इन दिस हिपी एरिया बिकॉज यहाँ पे इवन द गाइड टोल्ड अस दैट यहाँ पे बहुत ही टेस्टी खाना मिलता है स्पेशली इंडियन सो वी केम टू ट्राई द इंडियन फूड यर एंड आई वॉर्डर्ड चाइनीज फ्राइड राइस बिकॉज जो फ्राइड राइस जर्मनी में मिलता है इट इज़ सो बैड आई डोंट लाइक इट इट डज नॉट हैव दी ऑथेंटिक इंडियन चाइनीज फ्लेवर सो लेट्स ट्राई दिस वन असली ठेले वाला इंडियन चाइनीज एंड वी टूक सम स्टार्टर रुपेश को तो खाने का मन नहीं है तो मैंने ये ऑर्डर कर लिया जो मेरे को चाहिए था वो भी थोड़ा शेयर करेगा मेरे साथ the kitchen closes as 10 at 10 and we came here at 10:30 but still because he was indian and we talked to him a little so he said okay we can still serve we starters so we took this pani starters and this is a good decision so now i'll enjoy my meal night and we were again today in the hip area of talen we went to a very cool brewery there and there, it was so fully packed there was no place to sit we were literally standing but all the beers they had was so good like lots of variety nothing packaged or something but it was um, different flavors that you never had before there is eurovision competition going on so all the pubs here they are playing it live and that's why the youth of estonia has gathered there it was lively lively atmosphere we enjoyed it now we are walking back because we have to get up early in the morning tomorrow to travel to yet another beautiful destination of talent 
bye good night